Some UVM students and faculty calling on the university's president to step down over their concerns about UVM's finances and its core values. As NBC5's Zuri Hoffman explains now, they say they have no confidence in the president. A group of students, faculty, staff and others meeting on Monday, calling on the University of Vermont's president, Suresh Garamella, to resign. We have no confidence in this president. He either makes rash policy decisions without considering the impact or is too slow to act when action is required. The group UVM United Against the Cuts say Garamella has pushed a false narrative of a financial crisis at the university, leading to the loss of jobs and course cuts while spending money elsewhere, like on this multi-million dollar new sports arena and millions on executive pay. Including lavish extras like a $235,000 bonus for the head basketball coach in 2020. Consider the president Garamella's salary is five times what we have paid Dr. Levine, Commissioner of Public Health. The group points to cuts made in departments, programs, majors and minors in areas like religion and geology. And some students say they're upset over how the university has dealt with racial issues, COVID-19 testing, and their discipline system when students break COVID-19 protocols. The administration's commitment to diversity has never been anything more than lip service. Being forced to pay back $25,000 and losing your scholarship can alter the course of their entire life. A change.org petition calling on Garamella's resignation has received nearly 3,000 signatures. A UVM spokesperson sent NBC5 a statement Monday saying the university has been working on transformational changes needed to ensure success and stability for students, and they are reviewing program offerings that align with student demand. The university also says there's an $8.6 million structural deficit in the College of Arts and Sciences that must be addressed. In Burlington, Zuri Hoffman, NBC5 News.